Welcome to Sports Circle 345. This is the channel where we discuss track and field in its entirety. I know the world now is waiting for Budapest 2023. And one anticipated race that we are waiting for is the women's 100 meters. We have five competitors in that race that we are looking for the winner to come from. And that is Sharika Jackson of Jamaica. Shelly and Fraser Price of Jamaica. We have Shakari Richardson of the United States. Also, we have Mario Jose Talou of Ivory Coast and also Julian Alfred of St. Lucia. Now, those are the top five for me in the 100 meters. I know other persons might have their favorite, but I believe for the women's 100 meters, those are the top five for me no i personally believe at this point in time this time around the fight is going to come down between shelly and fraser price sherika jackson and talu i personally feel that those three but if we look at the races the diamond league competition so far talu we cannot write off talu we cannot write off shakari the only thing with Shakari for me, she's a little bit inconsistent when it comes on sometimes to big races. But she is indeed a factor this time around. I believe though the fight is going to come down between Shelly, Shelly and Fraser Price, Sharika Jackson and Marie Jose Talou. Alright? Then I am saying and in my feeling I believe that Sharika Jackson is going to beat them all. Somebody might be saying, how can you have Sharika Jackson beating Shelly and Fraser Price? Well, I believe that Shelly and Fraser Price will be beaten by Sharika Jackson this time around. Some of the reasons are Shelly and Fraser Price suffered a knee injury early on this year and it set her back. She have run a lot of 100 meters and those two that she ran she ran a 1082 and a 1083 though she looked impressive she was never really placed under any pressure my my concern is the rounds under pressure that world championships comes with she's also a few years older than than, than sharika jackson sharika jackson has shown that she can run in the 1060s region. Shelly and Fraser Price's best is 1060. Now, Sherika Jackson's best is 1065. Sherika Jackson with that 200 power. I'm saying that Sherika Jackson being in the 1060 region has a good chance and she's stronger and she's faster this this season if Shelly and Fraser Price messes up anyway Sharika Jackson will cut this goal my personal opinion I have Sharika Jackson with the 100 meter gold medal Shelly and Fraser Price second no somebody may have it other way around they might have Talo winning they might have Shelly and Fraser Price winning some people might have Shakari winning while some people might have the St. Lucian um, Alfred winning. But my personal opinion, I think Sherika Jackson will capture this one. Based upon the season so far, based upon strength, based upon what I've seen. Shelly and Fraser Price, yes, she is the GOAT. But at this point in time and this time around, she's not really impressive to me. Right? The one that's standing out to me is Sharika Jackson. Sharika Jackson with that 200 power. I am telling you, she's going to be difficult, hard to beat if she runs flat out and execute the race. If Shelly and Fraser Price gets a good start, then we know it's difficult to beat her. But if we know that Sherika Jackson is working on her start, and if Sherika Jackson um, starts out with Shelly and Fraser and is within striking distance with Shelly and Fraser, we know that she can run in the 10 region. She 
is going to be difficult to beat. Shelly and Fraser Price would have to run below 1060s to beat Sherika Jackson, which I've never done before. But this is the World Championship, anything is possible. But Sports Circle is saying, I'm having Sharika Jackson winning the gold medal in the women's 100 meter clash this time in Budapest. Leave your comment down below and let me know and hear what you're thinking. God bless you. What good my friend. And please remember to subscribe to the channel before you leave.